Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, please consider hitting that subscribe button as it does help the channel to grow. Today's topic is easily one of the most recognizable pet birds in the world, native to the rainforests of Central Africa and has a lifespan of 40 to 60 years in captivity. If you guessed it, yes, I am talking about the African Grey. The African Grey is said to have the mental and emotional capacity of a five-year-old child. But does that mean that all greys speak? No. Just like people, they have the ability to talk, but not all will be particularly eloquent in speech. Common issues that occur because of greys diet is vitamin A and calcium deficiencies, and this will need to be supplemented in their diet. Obesity is another huge problem that stems from food mainly, and I'm not just saying huge as a double pun. What is the best diet for African greys? In my opinion, greys can be really picky eating. With that being said, that does not mean that you cannot still give them a healthy diet. The wrong diet will definitely substantially shorten your bird's life. The most important thing to remember is that you should not be feeding your bird one diet the entire year. The diet needs to change as the season changes to emulate what actually happens in nature. For example, in winter, more seeds should be fed as part of the diet as this will build up extra fat. The Grey's diet will be explained in a future video as there is quite a bit to discuss under this topic. If your bird has access to the floor of the cage, it is important to remember to deworm your cage on a, to deworm your bird on a regular basis. I do this at the start of every season in order not to forget to do it. In every bird's cage there should be some enrichment. Unfortunately, you cannot just pop your bird in front of the TV and hope that it is occupied by Trump refusing to leave the White House. The best toy in a cage is a wooden toy, as the birds can shred this. If they don't shred it, they don't love it. It is healthy for your birds to destroy toys. Please don't buy so-called indestructible toys. Because trust me on this, your bird hates that. Like all birds, your greys require a lot of attention. You cannot just lock them in a cage and forget about them because trust me, they won't let you. They can be noisy at times. But not as noisy as, say, a sun conya. Oh my god. A sun conya. Damn. A commonly asked question is, what is the best size cage for a bird? And the correct answer is, there isn't one. However, there is a recommended cage size, and I recommend a 1.8 meter long by 1.2 meter squared cage for a pair of greys. However, the bigger, the better. African greys, in my opinion, can be bred from 5 years onwards. The best size box is 75 cm high and 30 cm square, and greys usually lay a cloth size of 3 to 5 eggs. If you enjoyed this video, please leave it in the towel section down below what bird you want to know about next.